Hi, everyone. Welcome to the uh, Google Developers Live Studio here in Paris. I'm with Francois. Hello, Francois. Hello, Alexis. And we're here to talk about channels in Chrome OS. So just like uh, Chrome the browser, yep. in uh, Chromebooks, you have Chrome OS, and you can have different types of channels. So tell us which one are those, and what is the default? Maybe let's start with this. So yeah, if you don't know anything about channels, you are on the stable channel. This is the safest one. That's the one you should be on right now if you don't know anything about channels. And it's like it has been full tested and blessed by the Chrome team. Really, that's the one you should be. Okay. You just need to remember one thing. Great. Um, so can I check? Maybe I've been fiddling with yeah, the, the sure. options. And so how can I look at and, and see where? Uh, let's have a look. Click on the Chrome menu here. Then Settings. Then click on the Help section there. And, and more info. As you can see here, I'm on the stable channel. OK, very good. So I'm on the stable channel. This is great, but I'm kind of adventurous. I want Are to, you? Uh, well, <laughs> it, sometimes. Let's okay. pretend. Um, and s I want to see things that I've heard will be coming down the line, yeah. and I want to test those. And so I guess yeah, there's, beta, there's is, a beta is, is what I'm looking for. Exactly. It's like if you, like you say, if you feel adventurous a little bit, just go to the beta channel, and you will get all the cool upcoming features that will come to Chrome OS. So are we guaranteed? I mean, these are just things that are not stable enough. Yeah. Uh, but they will eventually make it to, to the stable uh, channel. 99% of the time, yes. And, and how unstable are they really? I mean, how safe or unsafe is it to, to use that channel? It's beta. So there might be a risk. But I, I think it's fair compromise between security and, OK, I want to see what's happening. OK, uh, so uh, that's that's beta. Yeah. What about uh, updates to each channel? Are they different in terms of how frequent they are? Uh, they are, actually. Like, if you're on stable channel, it's like every six weeks, you get a brand new Chrome OS version. If you're on beta channel, every week, you've got an update. So this is pretty cool. Um, if you stumble upon a bug or a glitch that's, oh, that's weird, you can actually report an issue to Chrome team. Oh, can I do this from yeah, uh, Chrome like di OS directly? Let me show. Let's. Show me. So you just click on the Chrome menu again and report an issue. That's all. Or if you are like a keyboard, uh, how do you say, it? keyboard lover, you can just click on Alt Shift I. Took. Oh, and here, cool. And now you can send a message to the Chrome team. And actually, I was surprised, but they actually read it. Yeah, they do read it. Not really. This? I okay, can, very they good. consider it. So that's pretty cool. OK, great. So that's one way to do it. And if you're used to going to chromium.org and filing bugs there, yeah. just don't change anything. This exactly. is just a, a shorthand for doing pretty much the same thing. It ends up in the right, Definitely, in the same yeah. place. So Dev, uh, I suppose if you're a developer and you're reading the and you're watching this, you probably should try it out. It, it, yeah. It, the, the edges are not too rough, I, I would think. Yeah, that's true. Uh, now let's talk about something that's really exciting. This is the dev channel. Yeah, dev channel for development. Actually, that's my favorite. I am always on dev channel, and some weeks are harder than others, for sure. But it's pretty cool. You get all the cool new features that will, or not, come to Chrome OS table. And that's the best way to see what is coming. OK, great. So do you want to show us how uh, this yeah, looks like? I, I, little, yeah, how Let's do I go to the dev? What, it, what does it take? Yeah, it's pretty cool, actually. So you just click on the chan channel button. As you can see, there is three channels. Like I said, stable, beta, and developer. And if we want to go right now to the developer uh, channel, let's click on the chan channel button again. And bing, you just wait now. So what happens now? Well, now I'm so doing it's downloading in the background the updates. OK. And so maybe let's skip that part. OK, let's skip that. And OK, now we reached the 100%. So and it takes about a few minutes, yeah. depending on how big the update is, how big the pipe, uh, how big of a pipe you have. And eventually, you get to a point where 100%, and you restart, and, and there it works. you have those new features. Yes. OK, so that's super exciting. But there might be things here that I don't want. You know, no. It's really just too <laughs> unstable for what I'm doing, what I need to do. Uh, can I move back? Sure. And um, if you want to move back, there is one thing you need to remember. That will power wash your machine. So power washing is something which 
sets the machine to be like in a I just bought it mode. Exactly. So it so will no user defined, yes. no local data, nothing. Exactly. Like so like you said, local so all the files you've downloaded and not saved on your cloud. That will be lost. But okay, so that's not too bad. Uh, no. Hopefully, everything is on on um, on the cloud yeah. in the cloud anyway. So, um, but what about uh, the updates? Are these like full blown updates of Chrome OS you get all the no. time, and they're and they're big and 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 that's a cool part actually of updates. Like they are powered by the project called Courgette, which means in French, Courgette. zucchini. Zucchini. Okay. <laughs> and so the Courgette project. So basically, what the Chrome team did is they've built a compression algorithm that analyzed the Chromium source code and compressed it like ever to send the smallest byte to your device. But it's also a diff. It's not. It's exactly. super compressed and it's a diff compared and it's to. It's between two versions of Chrome. Okay. That's pretty cool. Pretty quick and like you said, like just two minutes and I've got a new version. So uh, just to sum up uh, this quick um, presentation here, um, stable, yep. development, uh, Death. and beta in the middle. Um, so that's great. Uh, there are ways to uh, send feedback uh, right from the, uh, the tool here. Uh, you, what do you use? I use the dev channel, but so let's, um, like you said, stable for everyone. OK. Beta. Uh, you're kind of you, cool everybody girl. watching this should try beta at least. Yeah, I think. yeah. You right. should try it. Report bugs if you find some, and and dev channel. Be careful, but I love it. Okay, well, if you love it, you probably <laughs> need to try dev as well. Yeah. Well, uh, that's all the time we have for it. Thank you, Francois. Merci, and uh, we'll be seeing you for yep. another short episode, hopefully. See Cheers. you guys.